I was because I was talking to my wife and I forgot. Um, welcome back, everybody. The music when you're logging into this game is always so epic. It really does make me feel like I'm in a Conan film. And the end game music, I get a lot of like mummy themes. You know, it's very ethereal. I really enjoy it. All right, I think we were working on. Oh. It's been a few days since I've played. I'm not playing this game a lot. Um, um, once or twice a week. Anyway, I've got a basic structure. I've got a carpenter's bench. I've got an armorer's bench. I've got a tanner's table. I've got a tannery. Um, right, and a bed and a chest. I think I need to make another chest. Right now it's wanting me to find coal. I have not seen any coal, and if I had to guess, it's going to be on the other side of the river. It's going to be on the northern side of the river where I found the... Um, ironstone or whatever, and where I died. I totally died over there. I got eaten alive by like three hyenas and a crocodile. Anyway, but I made it back safe, safe. What's up, Akazar? Um. The only one who has eaten any food is Blanca. Dora had some, but she puked after, yes, yeah, so. It's just she can't chew very well because she doesn't have enough teeth anymore. <laughs> Pero los, los otros no piden ni una comida. Pero creo que va a querer salir. ¿Cómo? Con Lea y con Rodo. No. Nope. Muy pronto porque ya es cinco. A las cinco media seis empiezan de salir porque quieren salir a casa. Bueno, estoy vivo. Yo tomé la resta de café. Te amo. Frodo, good mommy. Ah, Christy. All right, all right, all right, all right. I, let me let me get back focused. Chris was leaving the room with Frodo and checking stuff, so. The one quest I have is to find coal. I can spin another point. Takes more grit. Uh, what was it? We were working on armor. I can't do, or excuse me, we weren't doing blacksmith right now. But I need coal. Fuck if I know where to find coal yet. I also have expert armor I could work on. I don't need to do mason yet. The homesteader I was working on, but I remember I put it on hold to go get some armor and weapons. Well, let's go meander and see if I can't find some coal. What do I have for goodies? So armor repair kits. seen any around here. Like I said, if I had to bet, it's on the other side. I'm 
I see a guy. Target lock. Ah, yeah. oh, where's my daggers? Attack that thing all you want, buddy. Good luck with that. Um, I'll take the bottle. That's about it. Nah, I don't want any of Actually, what kind of knives are those? Hang on, how do you, like, preview what something is? You don't, apparently. You just loot it, and then you find out what it is. Alright, that's really weird. Stone dagger. Yeah, those are the same as what I'm currently wearing. Yeah, I can drop. 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 Why am I carrying all that shit? Alright. Keep looking for coal. When I looked it up online, it just looked like little black stones around the edges of these mountains. I don't know if that's the case for everywhere. I haven't seen that I need to, like, mine in caves or anything yet. But you never know. Does this sneak actually ever work, or is it just visual? Okay, that answers that question. You picked the wrong fight. Duck away all you want. You got to bleed on you, buddy. Good luck with that. Wow, that is a death cry. Holy crap. <laughs> wow, what a death cry. I've never... <laughs> that was like a Tarzan roar. Ooh, what do we got in here? Stuff. Uh, some of it's probably going to be heavy. I know I want that. I don't need the bedroll. I'll take the bandage. I'll take those. I don't know what that is. That looks cool. How much does it weigh? What was that? A lean-to? A simple tent. More information. Made of woven camel hair, they're deployed quickly and a little fuss and are quite comfortable place to ride out a sandstorm. Oh, well I need to hold on to that. I 
don't need the flesh map, do I? I'll drop it. Brick. Uh, well, I'm not overburdened yet. I don't know that I want to be lugging around a bunch of brick. I have yet to find any coal. Wait, is that some right there? No, that's probably just stones in the shadow. Yeah, those are just shadowed stones. Alright, well, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to go north across the river. Gonna have to be brave. Gonna have to be a brave little adventurer. Crossing the river. There was bad shit on the other side of the river that ate me last time I went. So the first thing is I need to find a narrow crossing. Because I don't want to have to get stuck getting eaten by a crocodile trying to get across here. Something, something, something. Heard something. Speaking of which... Go away! Right. Bob and Weave, it's bleeding, it's bleeding. Let it bleed out, let it bleed out. Oh, you got me. All right, I'm getting a little better at the combat in this game. You know what though, it's about to be dark. Croc. Shit, I just heard another one, didn't I? Bleed out, you big bitch. Where did I put my torch? Did I leave home without my torch? I may have left home without a torch. Can I make a torch on the fly? I need wood and plant fiber or branches and plant fiber. I have plant fiber. Do I just need branches? I just need five branches. Which I don't see any at the moment. Dark outside. The night is full of terrors. I really don't think I want to be here at night time. Because I can't see the hyenas and the crocs and everything. <laughs> like that. Something just growled at me. Oh, I got another one? Fuck me. Right. 
What was you? Uh, is that like a satchel or something? Hunter's satchel. A worn fang. Huh. Did that have something in it? Use. It did. Uh, it had stuff. I don't need the flesh map. No, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna eat some of this stuff. Cooked scraps of feral meat. Oh, that was a huge bump. Let's discard that. Okay. Back across the river we go. Is the wind picking up, or is that my imagination? No, I think there might be a storm coming. Maybe. Now the wind died down. It's pretty impressive watching the moon go down. That might be a good screenshot right there. Alright. Let's get back to my abode, drop some stuff in the chest. Make a torch or two. Give me thine stickies. I should take these branches. Take all. No, I forgot it was. <laughs> I for clicked the wrong thing. Oh, funny, funny, funny story. Um, let's make a torch. Okay. Let's deposit some stuffies in here. Aloe leaves. Where's the heavy stuff? Um, I'm gonna stuff these arrows in here. I don't need those. Stuff the bed rolls. I should cook the feral flesh, man. Do I need to stash anything else? Might as well stash these. Stash the bricks. All right, let's go cook those. Um, ah, the door's gonna close automatically. I'm pretty sure I left a campfire up here. I need to go cook some. Um, Oh, I need some sticks. I forgot. Find a stick on the ground. And I want some feral flesh. Yeah, feral flesh, baby. Oops. Did I click the wrong button? I did. There it goes. Oh, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a lot more sticks. I'm gonna need like another fifteen twenty sticks, okay.
So let's take that. Let's go find some more sticks. Sticky stickies! Oh no, I'm like four or five sessions in now. Anto, so yeah. Find points for set. I got a bed. I got a house. I got all the shit. I got all the shit. That ought to be enough to keep us going for a minute or two. Cook the rest of these. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to leave that to cook. Fill up here. Take a swig. I'm going to hold on to the simple armor repair kit. Good for now. All right, almost there. Three more to go. And then we're going to go looking for coal. We have 25 stacks of goodies now. Let's head on across the water. Actually, before we go any further, yeah, that's kind of what I figured, Akazar. Hey, Akazar, you because you, you know this game pretty well. Are there, like, actual quests in this game? Or do I have to wait, like, there hasn't been any yet. Or do I have to wait till I get to, like, a city? Do I have to, like, survive first and then make my way to a city? And then go from there? Alright, let's go across here and see if we don't get eaten by a lady. Crocodiles or anything. Yeah, I, I'm very happy with my Elgato card. I'm very happy I picked that up. That was a totally worth it purchase last year. There are journey steps? Okay, I may just have to look, look up a guide or something. Because I wouldn't, I, you know, I've played five sessions now and it's all been crafting survival and that's great. But I really would like to get into the story content and actually see the quests, the questing system, and or if it's a journey for storyline, you know, follow journeys. Because I haven't seen any, like, story, well, this is a bad place for me to look at the story journal probably. There's things that'll eat me here. all 
these crocodiles, man. What is this? I haven't seen these before. God, I love the music, man. Look at all the crocodiles. Holy shit, there's a lot of crocs around here. And baby crocs. Man. This place is dangerous. I haven't seen any of the uh, iron stuff either. Okay, so I, that was... Yeah, that's fine. It was just my question is I have yet to come across a single NPC other than that dude back there at at my camp and and he has nothing to say other than just here I'm going to give you a fun emote and uh, tell you a little bit of like lore drop, but he doesn't um, doesn't point me in the direction of any cities or anything like that. So I've just been genuinely curious. Because I haven't come across anything that would point me in the direction of like a town. Oh shit, there's a... Bleed out. Bleed out. For example, there's a quest line marked to the sky by a ray of light. When you find that spot, there's a whole new quest line. Anna, okay, that's like Akazar. And then Anna Cat says there's no NPCs in quests like a traditional RPG. All right, I'm just genuinely curious about what I would need to be looking for. Yeah, he did. He did mention a whole city of exiles. Right, but he didn't tell me. I don't remember. I think he just said way north. I think. It, okay, so that's about as specific as they're gonna get. It's gonna be just like, oh yeah, city up north. Nudge, nudge. If I were to look at the map, like, I don't even know anything that would, oh, is that a city up there? That's totally a city, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, wow, but the map's pretty big, too. Holy shit. I guess I'd never actually opened this up, so we're just technically in a tiny little zone right now. And there is a road... That follows the coast, it looks like. Or, unless I'm mistaken. Looks like there's a bridge over there. Let's go exploring a bit. I got nothing else to do. Let's just go explore. See if I can catch sight of that city to the north. Oh, that's the one I just killed. Oh, oh, there's definitely a structure up ahead. Oh, that that must be that ruined bridge I see on the map right there. Oh, it totally is. Okay, all right. Let's meander in that direction. Oh, and there's like a tower up there. Fuck yeah, now we're getting somewhere. 
hopefully not die along the way. Who are you? And should I be afraid of you? Holy fuck, he's got a skull icon. I'm assuming... Hang on. Is he gonna wreck me? I don't know if I've seen that skull icon before or if I'm just being paranoid. Oh yeah, I'm definitely playing solo. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I see it on the map. I see structures over there, so I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go exploring. And hopefully nothing tries to eat me. Something wants to eat me. Oh no, that's a bunch. Ah! And I'm stuck. Alright. We're good. As long as that dude doesn't come up on me from behind. He's he stayed back there. Alright, we might be good. Man, my daggers are getting the shit beat out of them now. Just out of general note, these stone daggers. I think I need a ten stone. Desert berries. Oh, oh, no, I don't want to fight anything right now. Oh, well, fuck it, I guess I'm fighting. Come here. Oh, no, he's going to leave me alone. Yeah, see, this doesn't have the skull icon. That dude had a skull icon, which makes me believe that he's probably lethal to me. Dun, 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 dun. No, I'm not worried about it. I'm literally just out exploring for the sake of exploring, and if I die, I die. It's all good. I got tons of supplies to make new gear back at camp. I'm, I'm not going to stress about it too much. Oh, there's a structure up top there. Oops. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Um, I'm gonna... Let's take a turn around and take a look at this. That structure over there. Akazar says the friendliest city is located near to B6, B7. I'll have to take a look at what that is. Hey. Man, I love the fact that you could just climb anything. Ooh. <gasps> Is this that uh, ore that we needed? Yes! Ironstone, baby! We totally need ironstone. And now that I'm harvesting, I'm totally going to want to get a bed roll set up. I hadn't worried about it, but iron is actually really hard to find. Where did it put it? There it is. I also have a tent. Can you sleep in a tent? This looks like it might be a cool place to sleep. Hopefully it's not a deadly place to sleep. You've discovered Shattered Bridge. Let's set up a bedroll on the on the underside of this uh this 
spawn point updated. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I figured it, it did say that was the case. B6, B7. Yeah, that's what looked like it was a city to me, Akazar. Okay. Yeah, I picked up the tent earlier. Um... So here's a question for you guys. If I if I pick up the bedroll, does it does it get rid of the spawn point? Do you have to leave the bedroll to have to have that spawn point saved? I'm assuming you have to have it deployed. The fiber ones are easy to make. I have still have yet to see any coal anywhere. But we did find ironstone. An ironstone was kind of hard to find, so very happy to have seen some of that. All right, northeast is the city. What is this right here? The remnants of somebody's camp. Oh, and there's like a bag here or a journal or something. What is that sound effect? What the fuck are those? Holy shit! Holy shit! What are you? And they just disappeared. <laughs> Leave it until you drop another? Okay. Press to interact. What am I interacting with? Oh, for stones. What are these? Why are these? What are these ghosts? Okay. Oh, here's some more ironstone. At least I found some ironstone. Yeah, I did see the book, but it won't let me interact with the book. Ooh, what is this? Oh, hello! A glowing tablet of some type. Press to interact. Slave, war maker Clael has ordered the sealing of the borders, including the destruction of the bridge. This is to discourage your treacherous kin from entering our lands. For hundreds of years, we have patiently welcomed your people into our lands, and our kindness was repaid with war. No more, bonded one. You will break the bridge, and as you do, think about the consequences of betrayal. Think about what your people have done to you. Okay, something about breaking the bridge. <sighs> All right. That was cool. These are obelisks. Okay. Hakazar says ghosts often provide important context to environmental storytelling or hints like to how to get through a dungeon door. Anna Cat says some are telling a story, others might show you and learn emotes. So you can interact with some of them because I couldn't interact with those ones down there. Oh, like there they are. Like they, they just walk down here. Unless maybe I'm supposed to light a fire or something. No, I don't remember what Arco said because that was like a week ago. So <laughs> I'll have to uh, press to interact. Oh, there we go. Now I can now I can interact with it. There was stuff in the way. It is proven wise to travel together. My companion has crafted a crude stone sword, one with which he applied with great strength to an aggressive crocodile. I cowered in fear when the monster attacked, and I am thankful to my companion for both the protection and the sustenance and the flesh of the beast provided. It tasted like chicken. We've decided to venture further north following the river, so that's going to be a clue. We want to go further north along the river. My companion has taken an interest in the black walls of the ruined city. 
I am less enthusiastic about the prospects of a safe haven there. Okay, so what happened was there was just stuff in the way that I had to, like, clear before I was able to touch it. All right. Go north. Along the river. Okay, so we need to just follow the river up. Let's go to a high point. Check out what the river looks like. I remember he said something about bra different colored stones in the bracelets. I remember that. Alright. This should be north. No, this is not north. This is north. Okay, there's the river down there. I'm going to kind of stay away from the river because of all the crocodiles. So we're going to sort of skirt the edges here. Keeping an eye out for uh, iron stone. And if I see any coal, I would definitely love it if I could find some coal. Now I'm on a road, it looks like. That's a good thing. Lala says, lots of hours and great memories in Conan Exiles. Oh, 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 something just barked at me. What, what was it? Oh! Oh! Get away, get away, get away! These bitches ate me alive last time. Nope. Run, run, run. Run, 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 run. Die, you little bitch! Fuck me, those guys are tough. Quick! Bandage up. Now, I have no desire to PvP. The fact that this has a uh, dedicated PvE single-player version, chef's kiss. I just, you know, really I'm just playing this to test things. Like, I was really happy to see my first Sandstorm the other day because I know that Sandstorms are going to be in uh, Conan Exile, or uh, Dune Awakening. So really, this is just prep for me to do Dune Awakening at some point. Oh, I need to equip some more bandages. I should probably set up... Oh! No! No! No, no, no. Run away. Run away, run away. Those are more hyenas, and I'm not equipped to face those in the middle of the night. Please leave me alone. Please tell me they drop after a certain... Okay. Whoo-wee! Okay, there's a burning thingy up there. Let's go up through here. And... Oh, nope. There's more up in there, too. Well, no. That might be a deer. Those are bunnies and a deer. Ooh, somebody's got like a fire over there. Can I get up here? Like if I try to scale that wall, nope, not gonna let me scale that wall. Okay, now I'm truly paranoid. Let's 
Let's make a fiber. Let's make a bedroll. I don't want to get stuck out here. Something just growled at me. that stupid bed robo there it is okay spawn point updated Oh, a tooth? I have other teeth. I have other ones of those teeth already. Alright, I do need some water. Man, the wind is something fierce right now. Do we have a storm coming in? No, but there's a hyena down there on the road, man. Frack, man. Oh, I guess I don't have to go that way. If I want to follow the river, I would go this way. Oh, there's hyenas there, too. Damn it, there's hyenas everywhere. There's one right there. All right, you know what? There's just one of them I should be okay. climb any surface in this game or is it only certain things that can be climbed oh my stamina though I don't think I can reach the top that's probably not a wise decision <laughs> okay so you can climb but it does burn stamina holy crap that's a cool climbing thing though that's a cool climbing uh, mechanic there's no way I'm making it up there I bet if I went over there, though, that looks like there might be a path up and through. I want to get high, and... Is that a lion cub? That means Mama Lion is around here somewhere. Does, can anybody in chat tell me as well, does the sneak mechanic work or not? Like, I can crouch, but does it do anything, or is it just visual? Because I haven't been able to tell that it makes me more subtle or anything. Get out of the way, little hyena cub. Hope your mama's not around, because I'm not trying to hurt you. Alright. I 
still have yet to see any coal. This appears to be a road, though. Oh, there's definitely... Oh, oh. Black walls ahead of me. There's something shining over there. Oh, there's an encampment down there of somebody's. Don't know if they're good or bad yet. Stealth is non-existent. Okay, so it's just a visual thing. That looks cool. Let's go ahead and follow the path. There's skulls along the way? That can't be good. Shit. Yep, run away. She tried to shoot me. Oh, I don't have any ammo. Shit. Where did my ammo go? Oh no, there's three of them. Um, oh, and they're gonna make me charge them. Oh my god, that was a lot of damage. Get away, get away. Somebody said jump off and climb? Hang on, that didn't work like I wanted it to. Oh no, they shot me! <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm not too far away if I'm not mistaken. Um, the question is if anything's gonna eat me along the way. <laughs> oh, that was great. I should be okay theoretically. I wasn't too far. <laughs> My little booty loincloth. Alright. Somewhere up in here. Because I got shot off the wall. Well, I need to avoid those guys. Those were way harder. Like, that was really tough. There's my corpse. Um, They, like, basically two-shotted me. Uh, loot all. Nope, wrong button. Did it auto-equip everything? Dude, it worked that time. So, Akaz, remember how I was complaining the other day when I died? It, it, it made me reset all of my radials, and it made me reset all of my, uh, um, equip, equipment, I had to re-equip everything. This time around, it worked. So I looted my body, and everything went right back where I had it slotted. Nice. What happens if you don't get it after 30 minutes? Anton. I'm trying it on the PlayStation this time, so I wonder if it had something to do with the recent patches they were doing. By the way, after having just watched Dune Part 2 last night, it's pretty cool. Alright. 
Now we got a better vantage point. It's gone forever. Oh. Copy that. Well, these are walls. What's behind the walls? There doesn't appear to be anything behind the wall. If you... How do you... I see what you mean about crouching so you don't fall down. All right, so this is all well and good. But um, I'm definitely out of my level range here, which is fine. I wanted to go exploring tonight. But I need to make my way back to my um, encampment because I need to work on finding coal. So how do I grab the edge... Jump, climb, hold. It says hold. Oh. No, that's not what I want to do. Okay. 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 Kind of understand how that works now. Yeah, that's why I don't pay. That's why I don't play PVP servers. <laughs> I have no desire to do that. All right, somebody's down there fighting animals. We're gonna make our way back. Loot any ironstone we see along the hey. way. I need coal though. I can't do anything with um. I can't do anything with the iron until I find coal. Do the pins stick around after you log out? Uh. I haven't seen a cactus yet. What if I use a hatchet or an axe on it? Coconeal? I'm looting this. I've never seen it before. Let's let's skirt around those guys. I may have to go look up a map. Um, oh! Alright, thanks, Akazar. What's up, Devon? Yeah, I've got plenty of aloe plants stacked. And the reason I need coal is because the quest requires it. The quest I have right up there for blacksmithing, it requires coal for me to advance that journey. Oh, and there's three hyenas right there. Three jackals wherever they are. Uh, 
Oh, and there's more right there. Oh, shit on me. Run, 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 run. No! Oh my god, I can't believe that worked! Oh my god! I need to take a minute and breathe. <laughs> Let's see here. Why do I hear combat? Ooh, you took damage. I took damage from not a very long fall. That's impressive. Got another one. All right, see ya, I'm no one. Even Crocs will only go so far out? All right. I need some old branches. Oh, I ate the wrong thing. Gosh darn it. Why do I have bad meat equipped in my radial? That was stupid. Alright, now I got food poisoning. Yay! Alright, last time I jumped off of this and I about died. Just from a tiny little fall, so... Let's ease our way around here. Somewhere around here are the statues where my home base is. 
Alright, it's got somebody right there. Oh, I'm a ways away from my home base. Gee, many Christmas. All right. Is that just one dude? Can I not harm him? Is that like a, a an NPC to talk to? About to find out. He's got he's got one of my arrows stuck through him. Sorry, buddy. His signs are nigh. His signs are nigh. Harken to the whisper at the back of the skull, where reptiles swim in the primal soup. Oh, that's a hint a towards. memory rises. A name, an ancient god of darkness and primordial fear, to whom once both men and beasts bowed, and whose children still lurk in the dark corners of the world. Okay. Read his name. Raggedy and red, Jebal Sag. Read his name scribed upon the flesh of prey, Jebal Sag. Have you seen his signs? In the long ago, the prince of beasts ruled all animals, including humankind, and all creatures communed in a common tongue. He once ruled where newer gods now reign. So something behind the skull where the crocodiles are. So. When other gods fall. His return is not No idea where that might be, but that's okay. The faithful gather and make ready for the sacrament of the hunt. The faithful compete to be his champion. See you the gathering. No, I'm good, bro. Thanks. Oh, you know what? I leveled up. Two more points. Ooh, I'm gonna get to my fifth and and grit or in expertise so i can my tools are gonna last longer now my armor and stamina of up gun plant i got passive health regeneration i should probably work on agility because then i can get some backstab all right we're good for now all right, we need to head. I need to eat. If you see a monster with glowing eyes, run. Double jump. Double jump is a minimum level 20. Okay. Do I have two different types of wood? I don't know why they're not stacked. All right. I kind of need to make my way back because I want to stash my stuff before we go any more further abroad. Basically, we just need to keep going this way. Hope we don't, don't get eaten by crocs. Oh, there's the statues. I see them. That's home sweet home. Oh, I see... NPC ahead. I don't know if he's friendly or non-friendly. That, that answers my question. Shit, did I hear another one? I heard another one. Did he just explode? Oh shit, that hurt. Die, bitch. Those weren't too bad. Alright. Any loot worthwhile? No. Mm, 
I will take the bandage. Gosh darn it. How do I take just one piece? Loot. There we go. Wait, was, was there a third corpse? No, I obliterated the third one. Yeah, I noticed that most of them stop following me at a certain distance, which honestly, it's, it's a really nice way to at least know that if things get really hairy, just you could generally run away. All right, Mr. Croc. Oh. Ow. Breaking my stone daggers on these uh, rocks. Ow. Man, you go through a lot of bandages. At least you do if you suck at avoiding damage like I do. The bow doesn't do nearly as much damage as I would assume it, it does. I got three I got three harvests out of that one. Better not be chasing me, big boy. All right, home sweet home. Jebediah, Jebediah, you home? All right, Let's stash some of our goodies. It's not enough space. Whatever we what talk about. Hang on a second. Why is it not letting me stash stuff? I don't want to take. I want to put in. Quick stack. It says not enough. Give all. It's telling me not enough. Sp yeah, but I have. I have space. I don't know what it's on about. Oh, it was overstacked, I think. Never mind. That made sense. There we go. That's what it was. It was bugged. There we go. That one appears to be... There we go. The stacking was bugged out for some reason. I do need to make a second chest though because I need to stash this other stuff.
Somebody's crying at the door. I, for the life of me, don't remember how to make. A box. Man, there's a bunch of things you can tell it to sort through. That's crazy. Where the heck did I make the box at? Oh, it's the construction hammer. That's what it was. I need the construction hammer. This is what happens when you don't play for a few days. What? Oh. Carpentry, building pieces, storage. That's what I was looking for. I need a hundred wood and twelve twine. Probably need to get some more fibers. Oh, I clicked the wrong button again. I hate it when I do that. It's really annoying when I click the move all. I herpity derpity. Um, whatever, we'll put all the big stacks of stuff in here. Horns. What was this? Defari axe. Ooh. Might hold on to that. That's gonna be. The problem is I don't use. It's a strength weapon. I don't use strength weapons. Stone skinny knife. Got that. Got that. Got that. Got that. We can stash that. I need twine, right? Which means I need to get some more plant fibers. Um, some more plants. Hey, what the frack? Somebody said something about glowing eyes. There's something with glowing eyes right there, man. bunch of stuff, some of which I'm going to ditch. Alright, I need some more plant fibers because we've got to make a bunch of twine. That's why I haven't uh, specked away from the bleed yet, because it's just it's I, it's just really helpful. Usually, if I can stick them with bleed, and then I can back off and pew pew them a few times with arrows, it works pretty well.
Alright, let's make ten of these bad boys. Carpentry. Nope, nope. Building pieces. Decorations. Storage. There we go. Select. Let's put this one at the base of the bed. All right. Now this wood box. Into this wooded box we shall put wood and we shall put stone. Uh, what else do we need? <laughs> Zathras knows. Mm. Zathras does. Zathras says. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and stash a few more things here. Let's go to the next one and stash some more. <laughs> Crystals, tar, shell back shell. But hold on to the arrows. I've got plenty of flasks of water. That's good. Actually, I'll take one of those flasks back, please. How did I stash... Actually, I stashed my... Can I not disassemble? Yeah, I haven't unlocked steps yet, guys. Alright. Let me go look here. Oh, I see. Okay. Thanks for that link, uh, Lysander Akazor, sorry. All right. Oh, no, I haven't done... No. No, 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 no. I've literally just been following different journeys to do the things that I want to do. All right, I'll be right back.
Dun, 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 dun. I've already had to do that sidekick. Like, I've already jumped around. Uh, I did, like, three or four journey jumps the other day because I was trying to get to different things. I was like, oh, because, like... Right now I'm working on blacksmith because I want to learn blacksmithing. Um, I did armor before that. I did tanner. I did survivor, survivor shelter. I did the archer, the sharpshooter. Um, I had started doing the expert armor, but I held off because I wanted to get armor for myself first. I went and did tanning, I think. Then I made myself my first set of gear. Um, now I'm working on blacksmith because I want to be able to make iron weapons to get away from the stone weapons. So my number one priority right now is fuck the building. Like, I've got a structure. Like, I don't give a shit about any more structures. Right now I want coal. Because I need coal to finish the blacksmith line. And that's going to teach me how to make new weapons, which are going to be iron-based weapons. So, yeah. Don't, don't worry. I got it covered. Great city, the best city, no better city. It is the only city for me. You know the jungle like the back in your hand. I love the music. Like, it's very thematic. Really, very really happy. You tend to build the jungle, live out your Laura Croft Tarzan dreams. Nice. Tree houses are great unless you're drunk. <laughs> uh... Speed timers? I have no idea what that even means. Alright, folks. I have been asked if I wanted to go get some ice cream. And I said yes. It's still really hot outside. Let's go look at what the weather's like right now. Oh, it's still... <laughs> All right, so it's cooling down right now. It's 6.30 at night. The sun's going down. But it still is registering as 104 degrees outside. I've been hiding in the air conditioning all day, but Chris was just outside doing chores. And she's like, hey, do you want to get some ice cream before I take a shower? And I was like, you know what? That sounds like a good idea. I'm gonna... I've already had my shower today, but we're going to go for an evening walk. Come back, and I'll have a second shower. And then I'm going to do some more work. Or I might watch Shogun tonight. I'll see. But uh, we're going to take a walk, go sweat a little bit, get some ice cream, and uh, call it a day. Don't forget, everybody, I'll be up bright and early tomorrow morning on Twitch only. So for those of you watching on the multi-stream tonight, thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to support Bits, Cheers, and Subs on Twitch. Super Chats and Memberships here on YouTube. That's how I get to keep the lights on and do this full time. So thanks to those of you who can and do support. There's a, there's a video up on YouTube about my new streaming schedule for the next few months, at least April through June, and probably through July and August as well, um, unless I travel, which I still don't know if I'm traveling yet. Um, but otherwise, we're going to be streaming bright and early, doing coffee sessions on Twitch only, and then we'll be doing our afternoon streams around this same time most days, and those will be the multi-streams. And I'll be doing different games for different streams. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to be doing Ghost of Tsushima only in the mornings. And then um, we'll be doing like Midnight Suns in the afternoons and some other stuff from time to time. And then we're still doing Enshrouded on Saturdays and Sundays. Yes, I'm going to go get ice cream with my honey bunny. My wifey poo. We took a walk 